wash my clothes for Sunday, hang up my tie on the line. They smell like hay and honey, so if you know that I don't mind. Gonna get myself a dog and a rusty pickup truck. From there I leave the city boys without a bag of luck. Gonna move back to the country, gonna live out in the woods. Gonna get back to my raising, start living like I should. Gonna slow down and start breathing, put a smile back on my face. This old rat and all he wants of your rat race. Stroke February 17th of last year. I usually tell a funny story about it, but I can't remember it. I couldn't remember anything before we started. So I, I don't remember if I remember it. I'm not sure if I remember if I've lost anything or not, you know. But I've, I've been married for 28 years. I still remember one more. Yeah, you know, I'm really impressed that she hadn't killed my ass yet. I really am. <laughs> well, like I ain't giving her a reason. Yeah, baby, yeah. She don't beat me much. I love her a whole lot. But uh, we last year, this last winter, we were up Richmond for for something. We we're coming back. We caught the last snowfall. We we're slipping and sliding. We decided we were going to get us a hotel room. Amazing. But my wife is a rule follower. She's had one speeding ticket in her entire life for going one mile over the speed limit when she got caught in a speed trap, all right? I've had more speeding tickets than I can count. Well, she likes to remind me every time that I get a speeding ticket that she's only had one. So anyway, we go to the hotel. Where the next morning, we're, we're, we're leaving. We're, we're packing all our stuff up. And she's packing all the bags. She's lining up by the door, according to size. Like I said, my wife follows rules. She thinks that rules and laws exist for a reason. I think, yeah, they do, because stupid people can't make their own choices. So she kept asking me as we were loading everything up, what time is it, honey? And I told her what time it is. And she said, what time is checkout time? I'd say it's 11. Okay. Two minutes later, what time is it, honey? It's, I don't know, 10.33. What time's checkout time? 11. 10 minutes later. What time is it, honey? 10.43. What time's checkout time? No one to scream. 11. And then I told her, I said, you know, if we're late checking out, it's not that big a deal. They're not going to evict us. You know, it's all right. She told me once again, she said, you know, rules exist for a reason. What time is checkout time? This song is right at soon. She helped me with the words, so I guess I owe her a third of it now. Had them people on their feet. 
and famous in Nashville, and I have to work for a bunch of dickheads anymore. I bought that book, and it came to me in the mail, and I opened it up, and the first thing it said was, find a bunch of dumbasses, and I'll pay you $25 for a book. All right, so what Tom T. Hall told me I need to do is I need to identify my audience. Y'all don't look like the big scoot and boogie crowd. I need to identify my audience and I need to figure out a way to laser focus in on something that matters to them. Something that they can identify with. So you can blame this song right here on Tom T. Hall. This is also known as the world's saddest song. Oh, 
we sing jingle bells. Neil and say she wants a Christmas. It's a case of herself. I don't really mind the buzzing or the battery she drains. It's just her cousin moaning. Makes it hard to watch the game. She says I don't excite her. Or something like that. I wonder She had to make new plans.
Sunday we would have a big sermon we'd talk for about an hour about the crucifixion of the Christ I used to call it Jesus Chainsaw Massacre and then afterwards we'd talk about the resurrection for about 30 seconds then we'd go outside and we'd hunt Easter eggs and I couldn't tie all three of them together and I got to thinking about it and I wrote this song Look out, Jesus, Easter's on its way. That's all there is. Nothing more needs to be said than that. But at an early age, I felt the call to preach. But the problem is, is I'm a semi-agnostic, snake-handling, Pentecostal Buddhist that says the F word a lot. I'm really trying hard not to take us as children here, but they got to learn these words sooner or later anyway, so if I mess up, sorry. But it's being a semi-agnostic, Pentecostal, snake handling Buddhist, ain't a lot of churches looking for somebody like me to preach. If you know of any, I got some business cards right over here. Please take one with you. So I said if I was going to preach, I was going to have to do it from up here. And y'all look like a bunch of backsliders and y'all need a good message. So hold on. Good 
Funny ones. I need to do a sad one now. When them dead, when them. My father was lying in his hospital bed, looking like soon he might be dead. Then he opened one eye before I go. There's a few things, son, you need to know. You can't trust a fart. Yes, that's a no shitter. Don't waste a heart on. So don't be a quitter. Take care of your teeth. Pour this up in a jar. Always remember. You can't trust a fart. He'll find you a man Just find one that loves you Just as you am Don't pick one for beauty Cause that fades away Find one with heart, son Find one who'll stay And if you marry for money You'll find you don't need a whole lot of stuff. Remember that riches all come from the heart. Put your faith in Jesus, but don't trust the fart. No, you can't trust the fart. Yes, that's a no shitter. Don't waste the heart on So don't be a quitter Take care of your teeth Pour soak in a jar And always remember You can't trust the fire So don't squander your time, son. Let me teach you a trick. Love everybody. Don't be a dick. Love all the dogs now. And some of the cats. Just live in the moment. Wherever you're at. Open your mind, son, 
and you open your heart become strangers but don't trust a fart no you can't trust a fart yes that's a no shitter don't waste a heart on but don't be a quitter take care of your teeth Pour the soak in a jar Now raise a member You can't trust the fart Last verse, I know it's a long ass song <laughs> See if I can remember yeah. Don't spend all your money I'll put some away You're gonna get old And need you someday Cause Mary costs money No, there ain't much in free And hookers don't discount For AARP Well, it's my time to go now up to heaven 